Hello everyone and welcome to a brand new channel that I'm going to start setting up uh, called Pokemark. Uh, my name is Mark, um, if that wasn't apparent enough, and uh, we're going to do a lot of geeky things on this channel, just because I'm a massive geek and I own it. Um, as you can see here, I do collect Pokemon cards and I've got my beautiful shiny Charizard that I pulled from Hidden Fates a few weeks ago. Um, and over the course of um, the channel's life, I will be going through quite a few different things, mainly Pokemon card openings, uh, but I will go through some of the other geeky things that I do have in my, in my room. So, um, yeah, let's just uh, let's crack into what we've got today. So I went shopping and um, ended up buying loads of Pokemon cards at cheaper rates than what you normally get. So I went to Sainsbury's and I picked up some single packs of Unified Minds. Now, these are a bargain. They're £1.50 at the moment. Uh, so if you can get hold of them at your local Sainsbury's shops, do get hold of them because Hyper Rare, Reshizard, that's a possibility. So yeah, go for it. Philly Boots. Um, I got two of them because that's all they had left. But why not? Because it's a crazy deal. I keep, I'm going to keep trying to find them and back open them on the channel. So uh, keep an eye on that. And I also picked up a random... Ultra Prism Triple from Sainsbury's. They're, for some reason, they're full price, so they're £13 still. But there's a possibility of getting some decent cards out of there, like the uh, Full Art Cynthia, so can't pass up an opportunity. And I think they're not going to restock with Cosmic Eclipse. They've not had anything since Unbroken Bonds. So if they don't sell out of these, I don't think they'll restock yet. So I'm going to keep trying to sell them out, so uh, keep an eye on that one. And I went to Asda direct, not a normal Asda, uh, and I was shocked to see Hidden Fates in an Asda direct. Never seen any, you know, Shine Legends or Dragon Majesty there, and all of a sudden they've got the tins, and they've not just got one tin. <laughs> hey, they got two, they got three, and they got four. So I've got four Hidden Fates tins, which I'm excited about. Uh, one of which is Charizard, so uh, happy days. Uh, so I'm going to start by opening the Gyarados tin. I'm going to alternate, so I'm going to do Gyarados, the Ultra Prism pack, um, Raichu, a Pikachu pack, Raichu, Pikachu pack, and then finish on the Charizard tin. And hopefully we'll pull some amazing shinies. I've still got about 50 cards left to get from uh, Hidden Fates. So hopefully this will go quite a way to actually fixing that. So let's crack in, crack on with this. Uh, I'll try my best to keep everything on screen so you can see I'm not trying to make it look like I'm getting cards I'm not. Oh. Just throw things on the floor because that's the YouTube thing to do apparently. Um, and I will give the code card away. What I found with these, you actually get a proper deck with these. I opened the, I put the Charizard one online last night and uh, you get a full deck of Charizard with the team up Charizard so it's quite a good one that. Uh, so that's a, the promo, Gyarados. I do have sleeves in a pre-release box so I'll sleeve them up straight away so they don't get damaged. This is a brand new setup I've done um, so, so hopefully it might be uh, quite nice set up it hopefully get a lot less busy on this on this screen as well as I get it all properly done so four packs all different artworks and I save the charge out to last because you never know I am going to keep the code cards to myself for the packs because I do play online so hopefully we'll be able to get some decent cards out of it. So Fairy Energy, Coast Trap, Lieutenant Surge, Magma, Charmander, Clefairy, Psyduck, Magikarp, Staryu, Reverses Mew, and the G the rare is a Clefable. Nothing there. Nothing new in my pull rate look. This set. Uh, 
Oh, I'm making a mess. So I mean, I uh, this is a very new setup. I've only just set up it last half an hour. So we have the energy, Brock's Pure Gym, Metapod, Giovanni's Exile, Clefairy, Eevee, Ekins, Paris, Caterpie. Yes! First poll of the day, Silvalli GX. I've already got that. I actually paid for to, uh, for one on Facebook, so uh, that'll make a nice addition to my collection. I love Silvalli. It's one of my favourite Pokemon. As you can probably see from the map, I've still got the Silvalli mat, the champion mat. Didn't win anything, so I'm rubbish at the game. But, uh, yeah. And then the rare is another Mew. So let's get you sleeved up. Don't want you going to any harm. Beautiful. Right, let's go with the new pack. Grass Energy, Metapod, Misty Cerulean Gym, Magma, Paris, Caspi, Deja Vu, Charmander, Clefairy, Psyduck, Snarlax Reverse, I don't think I've had that actually in reverse, and the rare is another Eevee which I've got loads of. And we'll go straight into the last pack of this tin, which has treated us quite nicely. If I'm honest. And Dark Energy, Charmeleon, Jinx, Graveler, Magikarp, Staryu, Voltorb, Pikachu, which is my favourite Pokemon behind Silver Valley, Jigglepuff, and Deancey. Not got that yet, so that's a, that's a new one for me. I'm happy with that. Can't complain with a new Pokemon. And the rare is Golem. So that wasn't a bad um, box, that, that tin. Quite happy with that. So uh, we'll move on to the Ultra Prism triple. Give you the code card for that one. So let me know what you get actually. So as with some of the older uh, sets they do have promos in there or alternate arts as this one is. As you can see it's uh, Burning Shadows at the bottom there. Uh, so it's a, basically a reprint of uh, an older uh, card that's not legal in standard unfortunately but still can't complain for, uh, for what you get really. Hopefully I might some, get some good pulls out of this uh, triple pack. So, let's go ahead and open these packs. Probably shouldn't have actually uh, looked at the code there, really. Forgot these uh, older sets. Sometimes I have uh, green and white. So used to opening just all white codes at the moment with Hidden Fates, so... Uh, Reverses Turtwig and Garchomp. Yeah, I knew there was nothing out of that one, so. We'll uh, go straight to the second pack. I'll try not to see the code this time because uh, then at least you guys get to uh, be surprised with me. Mount Coronet, Turtonator, Electric Memory to go with Silver Alley, Magnemite, Weasel. Magma again, Execute, Shinx, Type Null to go with Silvalli, and OK. So just to uh, show you, that code was green. That's, uh, that's a strange one, that. I'm not going to complain for a green code, to be fair. I think 
Well, Susan did have a few dodgy packs. Fire, Identify Fossil, Monferno, Autopad, Eevee, Vulpix, Stunky, Young Goose, Roselia, Cherim, and Drapion. So let's just uh, have a bit of a tidy up here because I've made quite a mess as uh, I always usually do. Right, let's crack on with the next uh, tin from Hidden Fates, the Raichu tin. card for you and the lovely Raichu which I've got plenty of now I've opened so many of these tins it's unreal I went to Sheffield Regionals uh, back in September and bought a hell of a load of these tins not surprising when they were like £18 each so one of each pack artwork again save Charizard to last because why not Fire Energy, Lieutenant Surge, Misty Determination, Pokemon Center Lady, Voltorb, Geodude, Eevee, Clefairy, Caterpie, Reverse Misty's Determination, and the rare is Ericus Hospitality. Another one's cards that shouldn't really be a rare. <laughs> it was a uncommon in uh, the last set you're in. So, Fairy Energy, Luke's, Luke Center, it's his strategy, Magma, Misty's Gym, Staryu, Jigglypuff, Ekins, Geodude, Cubone, Magikarp, and the rare is a Hollow Zapdos. Nice. So, nothing just yet from this tin. I have had tins before where there's been there's been nothing in them, so nothing nothing new with me. Giovanni, Koga's Trap, Brock's Gym, another Pikachu, Ekins, Coffin, Paris, Cubone, nice Magneton. I already have this. I traded it with one of my mates uh, last week actually, so uh, that's another for the trade folder. Happier days with that one. And the rare is Blaine's Last Stand. So we'll go into the last pack for this tin and we'll open up the Pikachu and Broken Bonds pack. Metapod, Giovanni, Koga's Trap, Psyduck, another Pikachu, Magikarp, Coffin, Clefairy, Clefable and Pinter GX, so that's not too bad. That tin are a bit on the wayside, but we can't complain because we've still got two more to go. I actually pulled that Charizard right here out of an ETB, which uh, it was the last pack in the in the box, and I was so happy when I pulled it, I nearly cried. So uh, beautiful, uh, looks quite good with the uh, centering as well. So uh, I am tempted to get graded because it could very well be a ten, which. Uh, will make me very happy. So, we're going to Pikachu and Broken Bonds pack. I couldn't believe it when it rang up on tilt £1.50. <laughs> Technically, I used my vou the voucher as well. I got through uh, the next card. I got £4.50 off when I spent £30 in store. So, technically, these packs were quite cheap. So the coin there, Popplio, beautiful little coin. Pikachu is the promo. I've got loads of these, so uh, 
that will go in my Pikachu pile there. And I'll give you the code card. And we'll get straight into this Unbroken Bonds pack. It's been quite a while since I've opened Unbroken Bonds, to be fair, because uh, of all the different sets that have been coming out recently. Obviously, uh, Cosmic Eclipse is out now, and the pull rates are insane in that, so uh, I will be getting some more packs. I'm getting a booster box next week. I've traded all my bulk away, only to get more back from this. So, uh, I'm going to build my bulk back up and get another booster box. It'll probably be Sword and Shield next time. And the rare Paragon Z, quite a playable card. I'm happy with that. Right. We're going to our third tin, which is our last Raichu tin. <laughs> you should see the floor at the moment. It's full of uh, open tins and packs. Uh, code card for you. And another Raichu. Another tin with all four different artworks. I think this time I will save new two for last because I might not have a Charizard in a Charizard pack. Fire Energy. Far Fetched. Brock's Gym. Chansey. Slopo, Clefairy, Coffin, Voltorb, Cubone, Orangaroo, another one I don't have. So I'm now down in the fort, low 40s now of cards I need to uh, complete Hidden Fates. So I'm happy with that and I see something shiny behind that. Charizard, double. So that's a good pack that, I love that pack. Get straight to the next one. Four. Leaf Energy, Misty Gym, Sabrina, Pokemon Center Lady, Voltorb, Cubone, Geodude, Eevee, Jigglypuff, Clefable, and the rare is a uh, Snorlax. Last pack from this tin, and then we'll get into the last Unbroken Bonds pack we've got. Fairy Energy, Cove's Trap, Lieutenant Surge, Chansey, Charlander, Magikarp, Slowpoke, Clefairy, Coffin, Reverse Hollow Energy. Which uh, I've got quite a few of these now actually because uh, <laughs> I've pulled a load of tins. And the rare, another Zapdos. So, last pack from this uh, tin. And then we'll crack into the Pikachu pack. Fighting Energy, Metapod, Jinx. Magma, Caterpie, Paris, Psyduck, Charmander, Magikarp, Magma for the reverse, and the rare is a Clefable. So that box, that tin again, was another alright-ish tin. Not, nothing too crazy, but you can't really complain for what you get. <laughs> I paid $15.97 per tin, so uh, again, they're not, that's not a bad price compared to where... Um, most people are selling the Charizard tins at 25 on their own, so... Uh... And code card for you. Another Pikachu and another Papaleo coin.
So, Gloom, Dodrio, Raticate, Wooper, Manza dry as hell, Cottony, Venonat, Meowth, Geodude, Slazzle, a nice card that is very playable in the TCG, and the rare is Pergly. So, nothing out of them two packs, not surprising because, again, like I say, you don't really get much out of single packs. I did pull my Rainbow Reshizard out of triple packs, um, so you know, there is cards in there you can get. Uh, so, the final thing I've got Charizard. The promo itself was actually quite playable in a uh, new box, so uh, it's, it's attack is quite powerful for the angel class, it's very easy to get hold of with the uh, welder and all that. Code card and Charizard, which I will be trading away probably because I've got loads of them as well. Got to go load in bulk as well. And just they keep haunting me, coming back. So okay, so uh, two Charizard packs in this one. So we'll go with new first. So we've got Fire Energy, Scyther, Brock's Grip, probably the th first time I've seen that today, Graveler, Voltorb, Geodude, Eevee, Clefairy, Ekans, and a Magnemite. I don't think I had that either, so that's a good one to go with Magneton. Uh, definitely had Magnetone, I remember getting that. Uh, so yeah, Magnemite's a, another new one for my collection, so that's three off the list now that I need to collect. Two of them, which are the gold tapus, and I need all the stadiums and pretty much most of the supporters. Uh, still haven't seen a Guzma yet, so uh, you never know. Might hopefully today, we've got three packs left, and the rare <laughs> and Erica. So we've got a Grass Energy, Pokemon Center Lady, Sabrina, Scyther, Caterpie, Paris, Psyduck, Charmander, Magikarp, Giovanni, and Lapras. Nothing there. So first of our two Charizard packs, straight away is a brilliant one. It's got Pikachu in it. One, two, three, four. Fighting, Metapod, Charmeleon, Magma, Pikachu, Ekins, Coffin, Paris, Cubone, Reverses Ekins, and the rare is another Eevee. Wow, is this going to be the pack? One last pack. So if you've liked today's content, do like the page and share everything you see. Uh, let me know what you got in the codes that I've given out so far. And eventually I might, do, might give out codes permanently, but uh, for now I want to try and get the set online and get some cards that I need. I do want to pull the Charizard out online. Uh, Charmander, Voltorb, Coffin, Charmander again, and Weezing. So, Overall, not great packs, but not the worst either I've seen. I, pulled, I got a Rayquaza box uh, a while back and didn't pull pretty much anything at all. So let's go through the pulls. Got Magnemite, Charizard promo, Orangaroo, Charizard GX, the Raichu promo, Pinsa GX, Magneton, Dustmind, Crosma GX, Deancey, Sylvala GX, and the Gyarados promo. So overall, not bad. There are quite a few pulls for what we paid, really. Um, but it's just all about opening packs, and I enjoy opening packs. 
I'm a little bit addicted, but you know, who's not addicted to something in these days? Uh, so I hope you've enjoyed that video and um, like I say, do sh share, like, subscribe, whatever you do on YouTube and hopefully I'll keep making new videos weekly while I've still got vouchers for Sainsbury's and while they've got stock still. Um, and like I said, next week I will be getting a Cosmic Eclipse booster box. So uh, keep an eye on that video. And I'll give a few code cards away for that as well for you. So uh, for now, have a good weekend and I'll see you next week. Bye.